Welcome back to another episode of the Royal Family of Windenburg. So in the last episode where we left off was Princess Cora is about to go on a date with Prince Edmund. So we're just trying to find a location for them to go. Um, and then I think we might actually just spend some more time in Willow Creek because if they do get married, they would... Well, okay, you know what? Maybe we can't go to Willow Creek because there's no restaurants here. Um, but for, the, like, if they do get married, they would be living in Willow Creek. So, I mean, I think it's definitely important for us to um, just spend a little bit more time in that area. I don't want to go to a restaurant because I feel like we go to a restaurant a lot. But we also have to go somewhere indoors because there is just this, like, huge heat wave going on right now. Um, so we definitely, like, need to avoid that. But why don't we go, oh, you know what, the, the, what is this called, the Soul whatever valley? Um, this is the home of the lady where, who, who, who oh gosh, who Princess Cora's ex-boyfriend, Sir Jav, Javin, broke up with her for. So maybe we, maybe you shouldn't spend, I don't know, maybe we can. I feel like going to a museum would definitely be something they would do. Oh, that's like the film museum, though. Would they go there? I don't know. Um, let's see. What's in Brindleton Bay? We have a lounge. There's no restaurants here. The bar. We have the park. We have this museum, the Dead Grass Discoveries. Is that even, like, a good museum? I don't really remember it. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we could go to, like, a spa or a pool or something. Let's see what else is there. What is in Oasis Springs? We have... A lounge, a museum, a bar, um, a gym, which that's not a good place to go to for a date. Let's see. We could go to, I don't want to go to like one of the coffee shops or, yeah. Um, well, okay, what's this? The Art Center. Did I put this here? I must have put this here. Windenburg University. <laughs> can we go on a date in Windenburg University? I guess we can. I didn't even realize I put this here because I haven't been really utilizing that at all because I feel like the teenagers and young adults, they would probably go there. But if it's an art center, it's not really like a home, then they like wouldn't live there. I don't know. The way I was playing it before was with the universities, I made it like a residential lot and I had like a bunch of young adults living there. Um, so I don't know. They might even come out with like a university pack or something soon. So that I think would be a lot of fun. And I don't know. I, I actually never had the university pack for The Sims 3. So I don't know like if you can kind of make multiple universities or if they kind of will just all go to one. But I think that would definitely be really cool for each world to have their own university. Okay, so here we are at Windenburg University. I am like just now remembering this. I love this lot. I downloaded this from the gallery as usual um do I yeah I have multiple like there's like four stories to this it's so cool it just like each floor has its different theme it's like the coolest thing ever honestly I, I'd have to find who made this because I, I totally forgot but if I find it I'll put it in the description um if not sorry but I yeah I have to remember who was the one who did this but I mean okay so Princess Cora and Prince Edmund are like super cultured um like Princess Cora is a renaissance sim so she just wants to kind of I guess just get a bunch of skills in all these different categories so she I, oh yeah that's it she wants to be good at a bunch of stuff so that's a good way to describe it I guess but so it looks like they want to sit and talk so can they like make coffee there's no there's no person here for that why don't we sit together and just chat together and then maybe they can do some activities together i i wish you could get someone else to take a picture of you but i don't really think you can but like look we even have like so this is the kitchen they have this like that what the cupcake making machine we have multiple stoves um this is the I guess science lab or one of them because they have multiple or the forensics analysis one but I'm pretty sure this is in the science area but it's also in the police uh, career um, and then we have like the bedrooms here so these are kind of like their dorms um, and then on this floor of course they would put this in the basement this is like all the dangerous equipment so this is this is more of the scientist career we have like that cloning machine thing I guess um, and then we have like all this stuff here oh it's so cool I can't get over how cool this is I wish you could like build a rocket or something down here, but I'm pretty sure that has to be outside. 
Um, so then up here we have like the photo studio, we have um, like a painting room, so this is where people can um, help their art skill. We even have like an area for if there's a child too. Um, we have the music room, we have this like, D so you could even study to be a DJ here if you wanted to. Oh, okay, so they, oh, why, where, where is, is this him? No, that's not him. Where is he? Oh gosh, the paparazzi's here already. Yeah, they've kind of made their interest in each other a little bit more public now. So, where is he? Why isn't... Okay, there he is. He's coming. So they just need to sit and chat. It's definitely a hot day. They're still wearing their hot weather outfits. So, we can... It looks like we need to flirt. So, why don't we just first, like, talk a little bit. Um, I don't know if they're in... It doesn't look like they are in a group conversation, but... I don't know. Okay, so... Prince Adrian, he is here. That's her cousin. So he, it looks like he came to study. I feel like this is just sort of more of a place for people to just brush up on their skills, which is kind of cool that they would have like an art center like this. So we're going to do a pickup line. We need to do a little bit more flirting interactions. It looks like we also need to joke around with our date too. Um, and then I guess we'll kind of just have to see if if, it, if they do end up having their first kiss. I feel like they will, because they just, they get along so well. Like, they're already having a, just a, a suggestive conversation, and now they're already both flirty. Like, it's so easy with them. With other couples, it just takes forever to get them to do anything flirty with each other. And, like, if you do something flirty too fast, usually they just get, like, the other sim gets turned off by it or something. But these two don't. They are just, like, it's super easy to have them do romantic um, and, oh my gosh, they're just, everyone's yelling around them. Um, it's super easy to have them do romantic interactions with each other. So they're going to do that. We also need to joke around a bit more with our date. We have this paparazzi lady just snapping pictures away, so that's kind of irritating. Um, so why don't we tell a dirty joke? Even though I feel like that's not something Princess Cora would do, but I don't know, maybe she's just super comfortable with Prince Edmund. Okay, so they definitely want us to kiss. So we're going to have to do that. Okay. Um, it looks like Princess Anne is a B student. She's never been, like, the best student, so that kind of makes sense, but she needs to work on her grades a little bit. So, oh my gosh, they even have dorms here. So if someone really wanted to, they could get, like, super flirty down here. I don't think they would do that at all. Um, yeah, so we'll just we'll have them sit and chat because there's just a lot of people up there, and I feel like they need a little bit more privacy. I don't know why they are all gathered. Is it because they are so famous? I mean, they're both, like, super famous. So, we okay, so they're sitting and chatting, and then we need to have deep conversations. So we can definitely do that. There must just be, like, a lot of light down here because they are both super overly exposed. I kind of, I like his hot, like, a warm weather outfit. I, I feel like it's very, like... Casual, but also definitely probably something a prince would wear if he's trying to, like, cool off a little bit. Okay, why is he irritated? What happened? What happened? Why are you tense? What'd you do? They were flirting a minute ago. Why don't we, if we, if we flirt with you more? Oh my gosh, everyone's just following them. I guess that is what happens when you're famous. Everyone just follows you around. Okay, so they probably should... Okay, we're already at a gold date. So this date has gone really well. Um, we can snuggle. We can... Let's see. We can tell an engaging... We can look deeply into each other's eyes. I'm going to just, like, remove one of the lights because it is way too bright in here. I think that is a little bit better. They are so cute. I don't know why they're still in their warm weather outfits when they're inside, though. Can we change, actually? Because it's bothering me. I can't see her face when she's wearing a hat, so... Outfits, why don't we just wear her everyday outfit? Um, and then we still need to kiss, so we can definitely go ahead and do that. I just, I think they're really cute on here. We could have Princess... Uh, Ed, oh, God. I almost said Princess Alice. Um, Princess Cora make a move on him. Um, we can whisper sweet nothings too. I think we actually, do we have to change first before I do any of that? I think so. That's fine. So we'll have her change. Okay. Oh, that was really fast. Okay. So sit and then you can talk to Prince Edmund. Um, 
you're gonna have to wait until you sit until we can do those romantic sitting interactions why are you not sitting come on okay oh i didn't mean to all right there we go this is <laughs> i just realized all right why don't we why don't we go somewhere else because that that let's see i don't know it just looks kind of spooky with the the um like the science lab backdrop so we why don't we go right here we can sit together right here um and we can have them kiss maybe i don't know we might not make it yet for the date but it'll be it'll be fine okay so we're going to have them sit um, maybe we will have them kiss. Yeah, we can have them kiss. That's fine. Okay, where is Prince Edmund, though? Because we are, I mean, the date's almost, okay. So, we will have them kiss. Come on. Alright, now everybody's out here. I guess they are now in, in public. Everyone is like, oh my gosh, these two global superstars, the princess and the prince, of two different worlds are on a date together like I'm actually witnessing this. Like, wouldn't that be a huge deal if you witnessed the prince with, like, a princess from, like, another country having a date together? Okay, they are kissing. We kind of missed it. Sorry, guys. Um, but they just had their first kiss. So they are, I mean, they're having, like, a really good date. This is super productive because their relationship has gone up a ton. But... Yeah, so they, I mean, they're, like, pretty much in a relationship now. I think that, why don't we, burning to death. Oh, gosh, okay, go inside. All right, that's fine. Oh, gosh, burning to death. That is so dramatic, I swear. So why don't we keep you from burning to death? Please don't burn to death. I, it almost, like, I don't like how easily they, they die from weather. Um, so we're going to definitely have to change that. Okay, so I was going to ask Prince Edmund to be our boyfriend, but it looks like he already left. So can can he come back? Can we invite him to hang out on current lot? Man, it is just... Is it even... Is it summer or is it spring? It's spring. There's a heat wave this hot in the spring. That's that's awful. Okay. Wait, is it spring? No, hold on. I totally missed that. No, no, no. Uh, yeah, no. Okay, never mind. I lied. It's summertime. My bad. Um, whose birthday is all the way over there? Princess Anna. Princess Anna's birthday's next? Oh my gosh, she's going to be a young adult too. We'll definitely need to focus her on a little bit too. Um, so Prince Edmund is... I just saw him walk by. He is over there. So Prince Edmund, we are going to ask you to be our boyfriend because this date has just gone super well. So I think that they would definitely make it official. Um, and they, like, probably had the conversation of, like, she didn't want to move forward too fast, but if they're just clicking so much, I think that they totally would start dating and make it official. So, I mean, this is also a huge deal. I mean, their, their siblings just got married. Um, they're going to be, I mean, their siblings are going to be the new king and queen of Windenburg. So, for them, they would be the new king and queen of Willow Creek, so that's also a huge deal. So maybe we would have a really big wedding, but probably just in Willow Creek not in Windenburg. Did you ask him to be your boyfriend? I don't think you did. Um, not try for baby. Did you ask him? Wait, I totally missed that if you did. No, okay, you didn't. I was like, um, so ask to be boyfriend. Why is there so much light? They're so bright. They're like, you can barely see them. Okay, so they are dating now. So it's official. The Prince of, Win of Willow Creek and the Princess of Windenburg are dating. So it's going to be a huge deal. But I'm going to stop this video here. So I know in the last episode, um, it was Princess uh, Alice's and Prince Henry's honeymoon, which they're actually still on right now. So it was their honeymoon, and they tried for a baby. So for the next episode, we'll see if she actually is pregnant or not. Because um, I actually don't even know if she's pregnant. So we're going to have to see that. But uh, thank you guys again so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share with your friends, comment any suggestions you have. Um, and I will see you guys the next episode.